this video we are assembling the honey pop-up card okay I've got all my pieces laid out here I'm gonna start with my base I've already glued my panels on and then you're just gonna fold it on all the score lines Flip it over. And then we're going to glue down this quarter inch fold that we just made in here. I'm just holding it a few seconds longer, make sure it stays. So I'm putting glue here. I'm just folding this down to the inside of the card. Okay. Okay, and then I'm going to just set that aside. So for the back piece of my card, if you use a lightweight paper, cut two of these because um, this is a, a bigger piece and you don't want you don't want it flopping around. Okay, and so. I have already put the centers of my flowers on. And then I'm just gonna glue this in place like this. And then the third flower I'm going to pop up with some foam tape. Just like that. Then I'm going to glue this. You can see where this goes here. And I'm just going to glue that right in place like this. This top one goes together pretty much the same way, except there's just two flowers instead of three. And then again, I'm using some foam tape to kind of pop that up. And then this one, you can just kind of eyeball wherever you want it to go. I think I'm going to do it about like that. You just don't want to go over the sides 
because you don't want it to be too wide to fit in your five by seven card. And then we have our B's. So I'm just pulling the wings up a little just to give them a little bit more dimension. And our bees are going to go I'm not going to put them on anything yet because I want to put the card in place and then decide where I need the bees. but I want to give them time to dry. So that's why I'm putting them together now. Okay, so let's set this aside. Let's put our front insert together. And again, I've already put the centers on my flowers. Now this flower, I am not gonna pop up with foam tape because, because it's so low, it folds down inside the card and I don't want to affect how the card closes. I'm only going to put glue here on my center flower and you can see where the two petals are. I'm just going to line that up right to that. Okay, so now that piece is done. And then we have our honey jar. It is two pieces. I have already glued them together. And a glue the jar label together. That's just going to go about like that. Okay. Now we can pull our card in, and you will notice that there is one. One piece that has a slit that's right here on the fold. This is the top. Okay, and this cent the jar is the center piece, and that goes right on the fold. 
our flowers go in the front. And the honeycomb, which is curving on me a little, goes in the back. Okay. So I'm going to just pull these out like that. I'm going to start here with the honeycomb. We're going to slide it all the way through, through the slit, onto the bottom. Flip it over. Then we can fold this tab up and we're going to glue this to the bottom of the card. Flip this back over. Now we're taking our flowers face down, just like they were laying. Slide them through the slit in the bottom, just like the honeycomb. Fold the tab up and glue it in place. back over. Now our honey jar. And this one is what opens and closes the card. So this one, we fold this tab up and we're going to glue this tab to the center piece, making sure only to get glue on the tab of the honey jar because you don't want to glue your card shut. So once you have that glued down and push it up and you see that this top piece doesn't go up with it. That's because we have to glue this top tab here to the center of just the honey jar. Okay, so you want to hold this down and again, make sure you only get glue here on this tab, okay? Now, when you push it up, it lifts with it. So that's why this piece here, as you pull it up and down, is going to open and close your card. The next part, we're going to leave this tab down. We're going to fold this tab up. And we're going to glue these to these, okay? So I'm going to put glue just here on these tabs. Enough to hold it, but not too much to ooze out and glue your card shut. Then we're going to take this over. And we are going to... Fold it and glue it to the opposite side. Now you do have some bulk in here from all the layers, so you're gonna have to just take a few extra seconds to push this down and make sure you've got it down really well. And then what you can do is you can look at your card. Oh. And what's happening is see this leaf goes over and so it is preventing the card from closing. So I will adjust that in the file. See if that did it. I'm going to have to turn it so that this leaf is in a different place. Okay. 
here we are. So again, in your file, you're gonna line that flower up. However, I have to adjust that so that it's not interfering with it opening and closing. I'm gonna rotate it just a little so the leaf is up out of the way. And there is the honey box card. And now I'm gonna put my bees on. I think I'm gonna put one on my honey jar. And I'm gonna put one on my honeycomb. And I can tell, I did not um, double my honeycomb because I thought my paper was thick enough. And you'll want to make sure that you double this honeycomb because it is too floppy. And there it is. There is the honey jar pop-up card. Thank you for joining me.